Hello guys, welcome back to Anon Tech Tube. and today I am going to talk about how to install Debian 11 operating system on VMware Workstation. Okay guys, without talking too much, let's get started. Okay, first of all, we have to download Debian 11 ISO image file. Open up any browser. Okay. Now type debian.org in the URL box and press enter. Alright. Debian is a complete free operating system. Now simply click on download button. It will open download page. Within few seconds, download will start. It's about 377 megabyte. Okay, after successfully download, simply close it. Now go to downloads folder. Here is it. Simply move into the desktop. Alright. Now I am going to install Debian 11 operating system in the VMware workstation. Open the VMware workstation or player. Here simply click on create a new virtual machine. It will open new virtual machine wizard. Now select typical and click next. Here select I will install operating system later and click next. In the guest operating system select Linux and in the version select Debian 10. Then click next. Name the virtual machine. Type the virtual machine name as you want. And in the location, browse and select the location where you want to store virtual machine data. Then click next. Specify disk capacity. Select the disk size for the virtual operating system as your requirement. By default, it is 20 GB. So, I am not going to change anything. Here select store virtual disk as a single file. Then click next. Ok. Now, click on customize hardware. In the memory section, you can increase or decrease the RAM for the virtual machine as your requirement and you can also do it later. Now go to CD DVD IDE. Here select use ISO image file. Then browse and select the downloaded Debian 11 ISO image file. Then simply close it and click on finish. Alright. Now select the Debian 11 and tap the green button to power on the virtual machine. 
here simply close the pop up message okay now we are in the installation menu select graphical install and press enter it will take a few seconds okay now select the language and click on continue then select your country and click on continue then select the keyboard and click continue it will take a few minute to configure the settings Here type host name as you want. And click on continue. In the domain name, leave it blank. Then click on continue. Now set up the root password. Re-enter the password and click on continue. Now type your full name as you want and click on continue. Then set up a username for the new account and click on continue. Now set up the password for the new user. Re-enter the password and click on continue. It will take a few seconds to configure the settings. Alright, now we are in the partition menu. Select guided user entire disk and click on continue again click on continue now select the first one all file in one partition and click on continue here select finish partitioning and write changes to disk and click on continue Write the changes to disk, select yes and click on continue. It will take a few minutes to install or requirement tools and packages. Okay, scan extra install media, select a no and click on continue. Now select Debian Airship Mirror Country and click on continue. Here select dev.debian.org and click on continue. Here, if you want to set a proxy, you can set or leave it blank and click on continue. It will take more few minutes to install requirement packages. Okay, here select no and click on continue. Alright, now we are in software selection. Select Debian Desktop 
environment genome web server sh server and standard system utilities and click on continue it will download and install selected softwares and it will take 20 to 30 minute depend on your internet speed Okay, here install the grub wood loader, select yes and click on continue. Device for the boot loader installation, select the second one, dev sda and click on continue. It will take few seconds to complete the installation. Installation complete. Click on continue. The virtual machine will restart automatically. Alright. We are in the login menu. Click on your account, then type your password and press enter. Alright, you can see Debian 11 operating system ready to use. Go to Activities, it will open Task Menu, Show Applications, and so much things. Okay, guys, that's all for today. I hope this video was very helpful for you. Thanks for watching. See you again.